In this video, I'm going to teach you a really simple blitz out of the Big Nickel Over G in our Blitz of the Day series, where basically every day on YouTube, we're releasing a free blitz that you can learn, real simple setup, and it's going to be very effective on Next Gen Mountain 22. Now, if you're new to the channel, my name is Cody. Make sure you hit the subscribe button. It's, only f it's free to do that. Also, if you're looking to get better at the game, I'd really encourage you that if you haven't picked up my Big Nickel Over G defensive ebook yet, I would really encourage you to consider getting that. It's only $10 to sign up for it um, just by joining our Patreon. That gets you access to all of our Madden offensive and defensive ebooks. In addition to that, we also update those for you as well throughout the course of the season. So if you want the best big, big nickel over G defensive ebook in the community, I really encourage you to join the Patreon. There'll be a link in the description if you want to do that. Okay, guys, the setup today, uh, I like to run this out of the cover two, out of big nickel over G, and really important, I actually like to turn auto flip off. You don't have to, um, but primarily we are going to use a baseline look when running this blitz. Now the setup is really simple. All we're going to do is we are going to pinch our defensive line. We're going to crash our defensive line uh, or slant inside. We're going to globally blitz our linebackers and QB contain. And that's pretty much it. The blitz is basically set up. It's a five man pressure. And what you're going to see is we're either going to get a B gap disengage or we're going to get that looping pressure from that linebacker. So again, um, all you have to do is pinch I like to, you can go ahead, if you want to just pinch your whole defense, you certainly can do that. Um, you're going to then want to make sure that you slant your defensive line inside before you blitz your linebackers. And then if you wanted to, you could actually go ahead and bluff blitz the defensive end on the right side of the screen and then drop the defensive end, or I'm sorry, bluff blitz the defensive tackle and then go ahead and drop this defensive end into coverage. Let's say you want to guard the tight end wheel, something like that. And you'll see here that this blitz concept will still be very effective at the quarterback. What's also really cool about this blitz, most people try to pick up pressure this year by blocking their tight end. And what you'll see with this with this in particular blitz, with the same exact setup only sending three, we're gonna be able to basically guarantee ourselves that we're not gonna have any problem getting this blitz in. There you see we get the disengage. We also have the double team splitter from our nose tackle or from our DT. Very uh, effective blitzing concept this year for me. And it's probably my favorite one, honestly, in the game. This is probably one of my favorite blitzes um, that I have found, especially against Gun Bunch. And again, you see right here how good it is against a blocked running back. You're gonna get a one-on-one, -on -one, even if that contained guts picked up. Most of the time it won't. But anyways, guys, that is the Blitz of the day. If you want to learn this entire defensive ebook, I'd really encourage you to join our Patreon. It's only $10 to sign up, get you access to everything. If you want to sign up for that, the link is in the description of the video. So make sure you go check it out.